to think that Crawford is scared of Spence, man. Crawford, bro, are you scared? Terrence, 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 you're 31 and 0. You've knocked out multiple opponents. You're one of the best to ever do it. No, that is. Slow down there, buddy. He's not the best. <laughs> I mean, he's up there. You know, he's the world champion. You know, he's a unified world champion. Is he unified right now? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. See, he was undisputed at 140. Respect. No, he was not unified. He 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 holds the WBO welterweight title, and he's coming off of a win of John Porter and Cal Brook. Cal Brook. Yeah, whatever. Spence already beat him. Sean Porter. Yeah. Yeah, Spence already beat him. Amir Khan, Glass Chin. He has, I mean, the guys he's fighting are bums, though. Like, the, uh, out, outside of Sean Porter, the rest are not elite. Cal Brook is a good fighter. Granted, for sure, he's no doubt a good fighter. But Sean Porter is also a good fighter. But. It's like you're not fighting you're not fighting the absolute best. You're fighting the second or third or fourth or fifth or maybe ten best. Crawford doesn't want to fight the best at 147. Why not? Why don't you fight this motherfucker, dude? What are you so afraid of, Crawford? Like, what are you so scared of that you don't want to make this fight? What is he so afraid of, though? Like, dude, you, you're one of the best in the world at 147. You have a WBO title that you won against Jeff Horn. But you don't want to fight... Wait, wait, who, who, who holds the WBO? Oh, no, it's uh, Ugas. Ugas holds the WBA title, I believe. And then, and then Spence is the unified world champion with the WBC and IBF, I believe. I'm not 100% sure. You can find out in like five seconds, though. I'm just looking up on my laptop. Spence, unified, but what belts does he have? WBC and IBF. I was correct, 100%. Danny Garcia, that guy is a good fighter. Definitely a very good fighter. Wait a second. This dude's crazy. Spence is like a fucking motherfucking crazy dude. Elliot and I had been drinking alcohol. He was released from the hospital six days later and was charged with a WBI. DWI, a class B misdemeanor. No broken bones, I'm a savage. <laughs> Are you crazy, dude? You could have died. Drink, drunk driving. That dude's crazy, man. That shit's crazy. <laughs> so Spence has a, a drinking problem for sure. Like, definitely does have a drinking problem. Problem, problem? I don't think so. But definitely does have a little bit of a drinking. I think drinking, he has a drinking thing. But he's not, you know, it's not a problem per se. It's like, you know, whatever. But, I mean, he beat Sean Porter, Danny Garcia. Those are like his best two opponents. And Cal Brook. Those are his three best fighters that he's beat. The rest are all just bums. Uh, Lamont Peterson, solid fighter. Cal Brook, solid fighter. Um, Sean Porter, solid opponent. Danny Garcia, solid opponent. Danny Garcia is like one of the best for sure. I think Danny Garcia would get his ass whooped by Terence Crawford, though. He's, he was definitely one of the best at one point. <clears throat> but Danny's not no slouch, though. Like, he's a serious, serious guy. But I think if Danny Garcia fought Terence Crawford, he'd probably get his ass whooped. For sure. No doubt. No doubt about that.
Man, it's like boxing is so full of shit. Like, what the fuck, man? These fights that we want don't happen. We want to see these fights. Don't happen. Okay, what's the fight I want to see? Crawford Spence. Crawford Spence, baby. Let's make it happen. Like, and... <clears throat> what's he talking about these days? Terrence Crawford. Let's see what he's saying on his Twitter. Can't listen to everything you hear on YouTube. They should have listened and followed me before I grew into the weight class. Now it's over with. I feel like I used to when I was younger on that dumb shit. I can't sleep till I touch something. I'm ready to fight again and everyone knows who's on that hit list. Sometimes when you, what you lost is the exact reason why you started winning. Boxing lit right now. We've been getting in every week. It'd be your own people that want to see you fail most of the time. Be the main ones smiling in your face and praying for your downfall at the same time. Pretty crazy. Wow. Can't break something that's already been broken. <laughs> this is funny though, like. <laughs> oh, this shit is funny though, like. But you don't want to fight Spence though, Crawford. You fucking scared the death of Spence. Fucking scared to death of that motherfucker. Scared? I don't know. He's a world undisputed world champion at 140. I don't think anybody's scared at this level, but why don't you want to make the fight though? Like, I just don't get it. I don't understand, man. I don't. I don't get it. You just it, to the life of me, I still don't get it. I don't understand why you don't want to make these fights. Is it because of money? Is it because you're with a different promotion? What is the reason for you not fighting Spence, Mister Crawford? Like I don't understand. I just don't get it. If I'm Crawford, I'm fighting Spence because that's the fight everybody wants. Oh, you guys see? Oh, we gotta build up the fight. We gotta build up the fight. But dude, like this fight's already fucking built up. How many, how many years do we have to wait for this fight to happen? How many fucking years do we have to wait for this fight to happen? He called him out, but that's like... Yeah, but the fight with, uh, you, you know, the thing is about the Sean Porter fight with Crawford. Um, that fight, I think Sean had one foot out of the door before he, before that fight. I think Sean didn't really take that fight too. He took the fight serious, but he didn't, he didn't, he didn't go into that fight, you know, with everything. You know, he had one foot out of the door. So, you know, he, he kind of quit, whatever. It is what it is.